<laughs> well, um, you've seen all of us talk about Susan. Uh, you've seen her kids, her husband. Uh, we have another message this morning from somebody that I'm sure our longtime viewers are going to recognize. Take a look. Hi, Susan. Vince Vetrano, News Radio 620 WTMJ. I actually worked for a number of years at TMJ4. When you were also there, you may remember me. He ruled Samsung copied some of Apple's features on the iPad. I thought it was a one shot. I know, but now you got, you're on, on okay. TV. I know a lot of people this week when talking about you have focused on what a wonderful person you are. Your personality, how your laugh is infectious, and how that really matters, particularly in the morning. And that's all great and should be discussed. But I definitely want to talk about what an extraordinary professional you are and what a dedicated journalist and reporter you are. And not that I didn't know it, but nowhere was that on greater display than when you and I had the opportunity to be up at Whistling Straits for the Ryder Cup a year ago. Good evening, everybody. I'm Susan Kim, joined here by my colleague, Vince Vetrano and Lance Allen. First of all, it was great for me to be able to share that experience with my friend. We're both big golf fans, and so that was really special. But also, folks, you should know, like, Susan works circles around everybody. Everybody worked so hard that week, and Susan just, with her energy, would push and push and push. We, like, had an argument, legit, over, like, I was like, well, I think I'm going to go out to the 12th hole today and cover this story. And Susan's like, well, I was going to go to the 12th hole. And then we were kind of at this impasse of, well, who's going to do that story? And Susan did that story. That was the right resolution to that. Look, Susan Kim has two speeds, on and off. Now, I've seen off. I've seen Susan fall asleep sitting up in a chair because working these hours, you get exhausted. Hopefully, this schedule change will help alleviate some of that. But when Susan is on, no one will work harder. And I'm excited for all of you in our late afternoon and early evening to have Susan, such a great journalist, reporter, and hard, dedicated worker on that desk for you. And Steve Shamraz will also be there. Susan, good luck to you. <laughs> we'll also be there. Aw, that was so nice. So as part of your morning routine now, because you, yeah. you're not going to be sitting here, you can flip on 620 uh, radio and listen to little Vince. Yeah, I've been listening to him from 8 to 9. He's doing all right over there. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, Sometimes Brian's on there, too. Yeah, he yes. does a great job. So yeah, that that's fun. Nice. Always having a good chat.